Alright, I'm shooting this short little YouTube for our friend Atomic Skull on Helifreak, who is concerned that rubber mounted servos can flex on an internal combustion helicopter, which is what we have here. This is a gas machine, this is a whiplash. Now you can see we have, sorry about the camera video, cyclics are rubber mounted right here. We're using the rubber grommets and they're clamped between these aluminum mounts and the nice miniature graphite servo plates. No eyelets, just the rubber mounts and tighten them down until the rubber is just squished. Now I'm going to push on the swash plate and watch what happens. Watch. Oh, the servo's not happy. And you can probably, it's hard to see. The arm is moving slightly. I'm taking up a little bit of play in the gears. Actually, there's not much play in the gears. These servos are brand new. I just changed to new ones after a few hundred flights. But what's happening is I push on it. Servo is screaming. The motor is fighting back. And I can see the arm move a little bit. But I can't visually see the servo itself move. So honestly, I think it's a non-issue. Now let me say I know it's a non-issue because I'm doing this for 20 years, mostly on airplanes, never been a problem, but I've been doing this on helicopters for a few hundred flights, never been a problem. So anyway, I really wouldn't worry about it. I'm not trying to be argumentative and just show you, it's not a problem. So get out, fly, have fun. Thanks.